This is the Rumor Report with Angela Yee. Club. So listen I, up. I think we should dub her uh, the Baby McMama. Baby McMama. Baby McMama. This is Baby McMama. We don't know her name. Baby McMama. All right. Well, if you don't know what we're talking about, yesterday on the program, we talked about a, a gentleman who uh, was bringing McDonald's to his child. He's the Baby McDaddy. All right. Now, it just so happens that the mom had the three, Baby McMama. three other kids, and yes. she was mad that she he only got food for his child. And not the other kids. And people started killing her because she threw the food and she was upset and said that. We've been talking about this too long. Right. So yes. now she responds. This is the baby McMama talking. Do we know, does she have a name? We don't know her name? I don't know her name. Okay. Well, baby McMama. Here Let's you go. go. Because I'm the baby mama who was upset at her baby daddy because he only decided to give his child McDonald's and not the rest of my other three kids. I have four kids. You knew the situation when you dated me. Our child is the youngest child. So keep that in mind before y'all make me the villain. That means all my other kids knew him. He was buying the McDonald's when we were together. My kids have to go through a transition of our breakup as well. Like, yeah, me and you broke up, but my kids got to feel it too. So now my kids have to see only one of their siblings get McDonald's. And not the rest of them. And they know it's coming from you because, of course, like me and you used to be together. They used to see you. You used to do it for them. But now you don't want to do that for them anymore. Like, to me, that's petty. Period, she said at the end of it. This is why, historically, black mothers have always told their kids we got McDonald's at the house to avoid these kind of problems. You do know when black mothers say we got McDonald's at the house, that's her saying we can't afford it. Right. But she did have an extendo clip uh, eyelashes. And she does have a brand new wig on, right? Yes. So if she could afford that, she could afford McDonald's for the other three babies. Sh- sure. You know, but I-, I think the baby big mama sounds entitled. And she got used to a privilege this man was providing. Yes, when I was with you, I bought the other kids McDonald's. Now they're not my responsibility anymore. And you said the kid's older. How much older? Because they might be at an age where they can get their own McDonald's. If you're big enough to cut some grass, wash some dishes, and earn a few dollars, I'm not buying you McDonald's. Question, how much eyelashes cost? I have no idea. I've never had them. Mine are natural. You see how these, these, these beauties Those I got on. definitely not yours. You crazy. And how much you think a wig costs? Ask Taylor. Taylor! Taylor! Because those extendo clip eyelashes, they're the long ones. Like, they were the long ones. Oh, that is that they really would call it extendo? They call them damn extendo clip eyelashes. <laughs> I don't know. They're just dumb long. How much are those extendo Taylor, clip how much your eyelashes? wigs and eyelashes be costing? Get on the microphone, Taylor. Yeah. How much of those eyelashes? Now, mind you, Taylor from like Philly now. So. 120 to 180. For eyelashes? Yeah. And how and much your wigs wig? be causing? I don't wear wigs, but... You a liar. I, assume, I don't. That one on right now. It's not a wig. Okay. Try it. But um, maybe like 100 some, depending on how they do the wig. So she got $200 for a wig and extendo clip eyelashes. So, Taylor's, yeah, so Taylor said $150 for eyelashes and a wig. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Huh? Yeah, I think them wigs are a lot more, Taylor, but you know. All right. You ain't got no big baby daddy yet, so. Okay. All right. Well, we wish her the best. $150 for some wigs and eyelashes. You need to stay home with that on. All right. Now, congratulations to uh, Irv Gotti. He uh, signed away his uh, master's. He did a deal selling his master's worth $300 million. So, congratulations to him. Drop on the clues, Bonds, for Irv Gotti. Cancer gang gang. You know what else, too, about that baby big mama? She just got to explain to the other kids why they're not getting McDonald's no more. That's all. Have a conversation with the kids. Say, look, me and him not together. He used to provide the McDonald's. Uh, we're not together no more, so that's why it's no McDonald's. Why why, why, Lil June June get McDonald's, but we don't? Because that's Lil June June is actually his biological child. I know it's a lot to probably explain to some kids, but you just got to tell them what it is. Yeah. All right. Well, and lastly, shout to uh, Rick Ross. Rick Ross, uh... Purchased a monster truck. He's always wanted a monster truck since he was a kid, and he purchased one yesterday. He said it's the biggest, my first Tonka truck. Uh, Rick Ross climbed the ladder because the ladder's dumb hard to get into, so he climbed it and he was driving up and down his property. So congratulations to Rick Drop Ross. Drop on the cool bonds for Rick Ross. And Rick Ross said that the baby McMama or the baby McDaddy wouldn't have had those problems if they would have just went to wing stop. Wing stop. Wing stop. And get, you, get you a 12-piece that's four wings a piece for all them kids. How many kids it is? It was four. four. That's three wings a piece for all them kids. All right. Should have got a 12-piece lemon pepper. They could have had three pe- three wings a piece. All right. Okay, and everybody would have been cool.
Salute to my guy, Ross. Salute to Ross. All right. Well, that is Salute your to Pretty V, too. Yeah, shout out to Pretty AKA Lady Lemon Pepper. <laughs> Lady Lemon Pepper. All right. Well, the People's <laughs> Choice Mix is up next. Shout out to Rosé. I'm going to try to get that, that uh, truck, that monster truck for the car show. Of course, the car show goes down July 9th. There's 11 days left. Okay, Your okay. Your favorite celebrity car. Shout out to Carlos Miller, comedian. He's going to have Los. some cars there. Shout out to uh, Killer Mike. He's going to be bringing Mike, some cars. Mike, Mr. Bun Rinder. B, 50 Cent. Bun. Shout out to 2 Chains. He's going to have some cars. Little Titty. Baby, uh, Rosé, and a host of others. So if you haven't got I got to call Duval, man. I'm going to see if Duval can get He gave his dunk to Snoop. Oh, he gave I, forgot to Snoop. What he, yeah, I forgot he gave his dunk to Snoop. He probably got something else in the stash, though. But he gave, he, he gave his dunk to Snoop, though. Okay. Snoop, all right. Snoop, Snoop got Duval dunk. Oh, all right. That sounds so crazy, but all right. Why does that sound crazy? Florida know what I'm talking about when we talk about them dunk riders. All right. But okay. say dunk riders. When you say dunk, you think, I'm a dunk. Oh, whatever. Got a, she got a dunk. <laughs> She got ain't nobody dunk. thinking that but you. Same way when I told you my quad was hurting, you all man, ain't nobody rubbing your quad. I ain't saying nothing about that. You always volunteering information. Well, get your tickets now, and the mix is up next. Let's go. 